Good morning, good evening, good night. Welcome to the exciting episode of Pokemon Go. I am the Nighttime Clasher. Let's get this exciting news about the Equinox event going. Sorry, I haven't uploaded for a couple of days now. I've been extremely unwell. As you can probably still tell from my voice, I've been super, super sick. But a event has just been dropped from Niantic. So here we go, people. It's the Equinox event. Uh, so the event goes like this. With the cool autumn nights approaching in the northern hemisphere and the warm spring days approaching in the south hemisphere, we thought it was the perfect opportunity to bring you the Equinox event. So with this event, starting at 1 p.m., on September 22nd and ending 1 p.m. October 2nd, you will have the opportunity to get double stardust during catching and hatching. That's a good thing. Lots of power ups, I think we can do soon. The next thing that it has is special 2K eggs are coming out with your opportunity to hatch Pokemon like Chansey, Reap. Lavatar and more. I'm really interested to see what the more is. Is the more going to end up being Pokemon like Shiny Magikarp? Like an increase of Shiny Magikarp or an increase of Shiny Pikachu? Because I have not yet found myself a Shiny Pokemon. I really want one. But that's cool. I'm excited to see what we get from these 2K eggs. The next thing they have also going to give us is special boxes hopefully they're good like the last lot we got not like the rock event box which was just terrible so they have items like lucky eggs lure modules and the thing that we have all been waiting for the super incubator we now know what it does it hatches eggs at 1.5 percent that's awesome just that little bit faster. I know for a fact I'll be buying a bunch and chucking a whole bunch of 10Ks in and just knocking them out a lot faster. But, but, there's another little bit of information there. When you register a new Pokemon to your Pokedex, you'll get triple experience. So all of you who have not yet found a legendary Pokemon, or have got a bunch of Pokemon you could evolve now, now is the time to do it with this event happening. You will rocket through the levels. In fact, I might even try and start a new account on that time and see how far we can get, how fast we can go up through the levels in just between the 22nd and the 2nd. I think that might be a bit of fun. And... The legendary beasts do swap over on September 30th. So we'll all have an opportunity to get one more Pokemon that we all haven't got in our Pokedex. But that's also a good thing for anyone who is doing the second round of the EX raids. If you happen to catch a Mewtwo, you'll manage to get triple XP if it's during this event. That's so good. Speaking of Mewtwo, apparently over in England... There has been an EX raid handed out on a non-sponsored gym. I don't know how often that's happening around the world at the moment because not many people are actually talking about it. But that's a definite good sign that they're starting to branch out just... Instead of just being pure sponsored gyms, we're starting to branch out and go, all right, so we'll go hit that gym over there and give that EX raids. That gives you hope that Australia will be soon seeing EX raids happening. And you know for a fact, when they start dropping in Australia, your boy will be out there grinding his little heart out to get as many chances to get on these EX raids. All right, that concludes today's video. Thank you very much for watching. Hopefully, um, we'll be able to get back onto my regular upload schedule. And thank you very much for watching again. Thumb it if you enjoyed it. Comment down below. 
sub up there, not comments there, sub it. And I'll see you next time on The Grind.